Hi guys, Ace of Hearts Fox here, and welcome to another First Seat Friday video. So today's video is actually my first P.O. Box video. It, it might be easier to open this stuff up without paws on. Okay, here we go. Ah! I'm so sorry for breaking the magic, you guys. So for those of you guys who don't know, I do have a P.O. Box that you can send mail to. I'll put the address in the description down below. But if you send me a letter or send me a package, I'll open it up on a video. And if you send a letter in the United States with a return address, I'll do my best to respond back to you with another handwritten letter. So let's get started. So the first letter is from Phoenix, Arizona. Um, let's open it up. <laughs> it's so tiny. I love it. Okay, here we go. Uh, ha! Oh wow, they put, the, they put the address on the inside too. Just in case, right? Dear Ace of Hearts Fox, I just wanted to thank you so much for being one of the YouTubers that got me into the furry fandom. When I first heard about the fandom, I wasn't sure I wanted to join. Of course, that was before I watched your videos. Please keep the videos coming. P.S. I love your fursuit. Signed, Snippy the Fox. So thanks again for your letter, Snippy. I really appreciate it. I hope I hope I read your name right. Uh, if it's Shippy or Snippy, I think it's Snippy. I'm really happy that I could be part of you wanting to be part of this community. And I'll do my best to keep the videos coming. Without, without, without breaking the magic that much. It still blows my mind that people would actually send a letter by postage, so thank you. So this next letter comes from Arlington, Texas, and I'm gonna cover up the return address right here, but look at that, they have such a cute little Lunar New Year stamp on there. Actually, Year the Rooster is my Chinese Zodiac animal, so that's actually kind of a neat coincidence. But let's open this one up. I try to be really delicate with all the with all the envelopes, because I actually want to save all these for later. Oh my god! This is so cute! They drew a little picture on the inside! Look at that! I don't, I don't know how easy it is to see that, but look how cute! Oh my gosh, and then it's a little thank you card, and it says, Thank you for existing. <laughs> oh, that's so cute! Oh my gosh! Okay, so I'm actually going to read the letter, I promise. Dear Ace of Hearts Fox, I really like your new suit. It's a shame you won't be using your old one, though. Do you have any advice for starting a furry YouTube channel? Thanks for reading. Sprinkles the Deer Cat. Well, hi, Sprinkles. Uh, thank you so much for your letter, and I love this adorable little picture you drew of us inside it. That is so cute. I actually did a whole video on starting up a furry YouTube channel, so I'll go ahead and put a link in the description below. But honestly, if I had to give one piece of advice for starting up a furry YouTube channel, it would be to do something that you enjoy and do something that you have a lot of fun with. So many people get caught up in trying to figure out what's popular and what's not popular, and they kind of forget to just do something that they want to do every day. If you do something you love, you never want to stop doing it. And honestly, that quality and passion is going to show when you're on camera. So thank you so much for this letter. That is so cute. I love the little card. So I love being able to save things like this. That's what's so cool about a physical letter is there's something really personal when you see someone's handwriting on it. Okay, on to the next letter. So this one is from Tustin, California. Let's, let's open it up. Ooh, oh my gosh. They sent me hyena agenda stickers. I love hyena agenda. Oh my gosh. Yeah, well, I'm wearing a hyena agenda jacket right now. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. Look at these cool stickers. Look at the stickers. Oh, I love it. Oh, these are so cool. These are actually one of the few ones that I don't have yet, so thank you. But wait, there's more. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. It's a picture of my persona, and I have this jacket that I commissioned that I always wear, and they drew him wearing it. Oh, that's so cute! I love it! Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this down and actually read the letter. Hey Ace, it's me, Zakano, aka Sebastian. I saw your video of thinking about doing a P.O. Box video, so here's something to help. Sorry if this is horrible writing to read, by the way. Actually, you know what? I have awful handwriting myself, so, like, this is actually really good compared to my handwriting. <laughs> but hey, everyone has their own writing style. Exactly. Anyway, hope everything's okay for you and everyone else, and glad to see you're doing great on YouTube. Maybe one day we'll meet in person again, and perhaps hang out to get to know one another better. If you need help on something in your videos, or something else, I can help too. But that's up to you. Oh, and out of curiosity, do you have a favorite furry character from a video game, movie, cartoon, or TV? If I had to pick out one character, it'd probably be Robin Hood. He is my favorite Disney character and probably one of my favorite furry characters of all time. Just saying as well to break the ice a little, and mine's Zilla Jr. from Godzilla the Series. Oh well, I hope to hear back from you, and sorry if this seemed awkward. See you around then, and thanks for the read. 
Sakano, Sakara, Sebastian. P.S. I hope you enjoy the stickers and sketches. <laughs> P.P.S. Don't know if you want to write back, but just in case, oh, and then he left his uh, he left his address back on here. Well, I would love to write back to you, and thank you so much for your letter. And oh my gosh, like the picture and the stickers, this is so cool. Again, it blows my mind that anybody would send anything anymore, especially living in the age of the internet. So little things like these, I absolutely treasure them. So thank you so much. And if you see me at a convention, I would love to meet you and say hi. And I'll go ahead and write back to you as soon as I can. Okay, so the last piece of mail today is a box. It's a box. It's a big old box. I don't know where I don't know where to open it. Oh, it's post NL. So I think it th that means it might be from the Netherlands. Did someone send me international mail? I'm gonna try not to move this around too much so I don't break it. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna open it up. This is so hard to do with a fursuit head on. Ah! I almost got it. I almost got it. Aha! That's right, box. You cannot defeat me. I am a person in an animal costume. I am too powerful for boxes. Ah! Okay, I think I might be messing this up. There we go. Aha! Aw. It says four fox. I don't know if you can read that. Look at that! Poor Fox! Oh my god, okay. Look at this, they sent all these like, all these little candies from the Netherlands! Oh, this is so cool! Oh, this is so cute. Look at this! Candy Sushi! Candy Sushi! This is so cool! What else? There's more stuff in here? Look at this, they sent like fudge brownies? Oh my god! There's so much stuff in here! Actually, black licorice is one of my favorite candies. What's this? They said like, oh, these are so cute! Look at these, they're little hearts! They're little hearts! And they wrote a little note with the hearts! This is so cute! This is a rose quartz. The small one is for you. I had a cool idea in mind for the big-hearted stones. So the rose quartz is for sending around the furry fandom. The clear crystal is the same purpose but outside the fandom. Also, I hope that people would make a photo if they got the stone with the country and city they live in. Oh, it's a, okay, so he, he wants me to use the hashtag traveling love stone. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so I'm gonna put the stones back in this little baggie so I don't, oh crap. I got a snake buddy. I got a snake buddy. Let's see. Snake buddy! Okay, but can we talk about like how much I love the idea behind these? So if I'm if I'm doing this right, he says, okay, so I'm pa he's passing the little heart along to me, so he's gonna have me hang on to that one. And then I send this one to someone in the furry fandom who needs some love, and then send this one to someone outside the furry fandom who needs some love. I I, I love this. It just pass it along the love. I'ma put them back in their little bag. Back in the baggie with you. I need to keep the love safe. Ah, yes, I got Roombo to Waffle <laughs> I, I, I don't know how to read this. If I'm gonna guess, they're little waffle candies. These are so cool. And he sent me the world's cutest package of chocolate chip cookies. This is so cute. I mean, just like anything in a foreign language is automatically cute, especially when it's just like a milk and purr. <laughs> Little gr glow in the dark paracord bracelet. I'm, I'm gonna wear this too. I'm gonna wear that. I got my paracord bracelet and my snake buddy. And it came with like a little thingy. Look at this little flip book thingy. So it's like, it starts with a picture of me and then turns into a little ace of hearts. And then look at this. Then it says proud furry on the back. I am a proud furry. I like this. <laughs> I should like hang this from my uh, from my rear view mirror in my car, so then people can be like, if they if they know what it is, then they can be like, ah, this guy's a furry. I like it. This is so cool. It looks like he maybe cut this out of wood and then like colored it in. That's really neat. Snake buddy, snake buddy, please, you need to stay. And check this out. He gave me a little necklace. Give me a little necklace. I can't put it over my head, so I'm gonna hang it on my snoot. Anyways, thank you guys so much for joining me on my first P.O. Box video. This was so cool. We got some art and, like, some stuff. And the folks who had return addresses on their letters, I will be sending a letter back to you, so keep your eyes on the mail. So thanks again for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I know it wasn't super content-heavy, but it was so cool to just be able to, like, 
open up little packages and have a snake buddy. So thanks again for watching everybody. I hope you all enjoyed today's video. If you like this video, go ahead and hit like and subscribe down below or just leave me a comment. Uh, if you guys want to send me some more mail for the next P.O. Box video, I'm also going to put that address probably like right here or put it in the description below. And um, <laughs> I'm just still blown away by this. I'm sorry if I'm stuttering over my words. I, I just have this big dumb smile on underneath my fursuit head. Actually, you know what? I'm, <laughs> I'm going to break the magic a little bit more because I this is too cool. There's something really cool about having that physical connection of being able to write each other and see that someone, you know, took a pen to paper and wrote out a message. So, so thank you guys so much for doing this. Um, I know I said thank you like a million times, but this is just the coolest thing and I love being able to connect with you all. So even though I look all sweaty and gross, thanks again for watching. My name is Ace of Hearts Box and I will see you all in the next video. Pshh.